got this or your dick look? <laughs> I actually got some today. Oh, yeah. That's fucking nice. Yes, it is. Put some uh, chapstick or your dick look. <laughs> I actually got some today. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we're We have uh, seven okay. regular aluminum yeah. and six IR. Oh, cool. Yes, Good. Sir. Tunk at the bottom. You going to confirm that it's there? Okay. Okay, Roger. Put that too as well. Okay, cool. Let's see. Here's the 10 mark. Mm -hmm. 10 seconds. Mm -hmm. Up 20. Mm -hmm. Don't go backwards. Just go all the way around, sir. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Viking six Romeo, you're fucking saving six. Yeah, Roger. Hang it! You good? Drop it. All right. Fire! Shot over. Hey, 
Yeah. Hey, go ahead and move over this way because we're gonna. Don't you guys get ramp caught? Yep. I feel like I came for a reason. Ah, you did. I'm probably gonna steal your uh, satcom. Yeah. You guys be going up to the OP. So yeah. And uh, Carlson can use that to talk to squad down here. And Absolutely. Everything. Sounds good. Yeah, just if you hang out with him as part of this operation, Saber Blitzkrieg, to uh, influence the enemy as he attempts to uh, bring lethal aid uh, out of Pakistan into the Kandahar area, and then uh, and also uh, hone these skills of our soldiers as they continue combat operations until the end of our tour here in Afghanistan. And more importantly, they can take those skills with them throughout the rest of their career, knowing that they came here to Afghanistan, achieved the mission, and then. Uh, compare their younger next generation of soldiers in the preparation for uh, further combat operations that may be held anywhere around the world. Cache material, you can hide it anywhere in here. Oh, we're just recovering the vehicle that we got stuck in a riverbed. Second thing, sometimes going forward is not the best option. Sometimes going Backwards is the best option. It's flat. Over there is crevasses everywhere. Now you can bring in the guns, baby. Six, Saber six, go ahead and sit Need you to move from south to north, uh, egressing uh, to the west, and request uh, guns and rockets uh, on inbound. I'll clear your hot over. Saber six, Roger over. Neutralized. Oh, here they come. A five one uh, saber six uh, in the mission. Okay. Redetermine your uh, direction and distance to send it back to Comanche five one over. Oh, good. 30, 40 feet down, so it wow. doesn't take much to get up to the surface, and obviously you can pretty much grow anything out here. It's a little bit of water, plenty of sunlight, obviously. So. Uh.
Hang it. Five. One more. One more. Round complete over. No, that was three rounds. That's three rounds. That's it. Push up the Right now, so. Okay, yeah. What we're doing today is conducting Operation Saber Blitzkrieg. Essentially what we're doing today is uh, we're on the south side of the uh, Daman district here in uh, Kandahar province, Afghanistan. This operation is a fire support operation where we're essentially exercising our ability to integrate uh, both 60 millimeter and 120 millimeter uh, mortars in conjunction with both rotor wing and fixed wing aviation. What we're trying to achieve here is an effect where not only through training but also uh, through our simple employment of these systems in conjunction with one another, we're attempting to influence the enemy's uh, rat lines or his line supplies. They come through the Registan Desert here in Kandahar. The Operation uh, Saber Blitzkrieg today, not only were we able to provide uh, enemy effects on his rat lines coming out of the Registrant Desert in the Kandahar province, we we'll also have the ability to uh, conduct training. And what is done today is allowed our, our mortar sections, both 60s and 120s, the ability to work as a team to finally tune themselves so we can continue uh, conducting operations against the enemy. At home station in Vilsack, Germany, you know, we, we conduct this training on a regular basis. Here, we're actually in enemy territory uh, conducting training. And what it has provided us is the ability to uh, not only hone our systems to get more responsive in our fires, but also is provided us the ability to uh, become more responsive. So as we continue to conduct operations throughout our AO, we'll be able to engage the enemy who presents yourself on the battlefield. What's also unique about this operation is uh, we brought uh, Intel assets with us, so as we conduct these operations, we'll be able to uh, conduct intelligent collection, uh, both through human and SIGINT, on the enemy, as obviously being in uh, enemy territory out here, he's probably observing us and wondering what we're doing out here uh, through this operation. Through that intelligence collection that we are doing today and tonight, we'll be able to take that information in, uh, cross cue that with other intelligence information, and hopefully be able to provide our forces follow on maneuver operations in order to uh, conduct um, either kinetic or non-kinetic operations against uh, Taliban forces located here both in the Dan and the Mon districts. Okay. <laughs> 